got this 2014 5.3 L83 engine with active fuel management, variable cam timing, and GDI injection. And it came in because it was missing. Well, uh, when we checked it out, we noticed we didn't have much compression in one cylinder. So the cam's out, and this is a not a good situation. So we're going to end up fixing this old motor and do a uh, DOD delete on it. Working on our 2014 Chevy truck. There's the cam robe that's junk. And it looks like the roller is gone off the lifter. So it looks like the roller failed on the lifter and chewed the cam up on this old girl. Alright, here's the money shot on our 2014 Chevy truck. There's Mr. Cam Lobe, there's Mr. Lifter who gave up the ghost, so. That lifter failed and that's what screwed up that cam. So we're gonna do the DOD delete here for melling and go ahead and rebuild this engine. More in our L83 last cylinder. 2014 Chevy pick'em up truck. Working on our L83 53 LT engine. Cut an intake to see here. Using our Storm 5th or Storm 85 head block master to deck the heads, taking 4,000 saw. Just a cleanup cut, make them look nice. Okay, let's check our uh, seat seal here on this 2014 Silverado L8353. We're overhauling because we can't get an engine from anywhere, so we're forced to do it. <laughs> That's holding really good. Yeah, this thing's gonna have like 220 pounds compression when we're done. part of our DOD delete here on this uh, Gen 5 L83 5.3 engine and what we got to do is we got to block all these oil holes off see there's eight holes here cylinder one cylinder seven cylinder four cylinder six so we can take an exhaust um, otherwise we have a massive oil leak so this is my oil feed coming into my Loma lifter oil manifold so we're gonna leave this go because our oil pressure sending units up here so what we're gonna do is we got these plugs from Lingenfelder Okay. And they're basically just rivets. So we're going to use our handy dandy 
big time rivet gun here. And we're gonna pop these rivets into those eight holes. Okay, I've got the rivets in, all my AFM lifter holes. Work really nice, and I'm ready to install the Loma, which isn't gonna do nothing now, because see, these are where the oil comes in. These are the solenoids that do the deactivation. So we're gonna put that cover back on, and that'll never know what the hell's going on. All right, we got our L83 all done. DOD delete is done. High pressure fuel systems installed. Hopefully it runs. So we should find out here soon. Our DOD delete. Okay, elevate the R's. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>